The downside to being on your purpose is that some women will label you as a beta male provider. This simply means they're recognizing the potential for relationship and therefore withholding sex from us, though there are plenty more upsides too. I teach men how to find fulfillment outside of woman in life so we can improve our living situation happiness which usually makes it easier when dating comes around again because these traits increase attraction factor exponentially. Women have two strategies to get a guy to be committed to them. The first one is she'll hold out on sex usually claiming celibacy, then they can be boyfriend slash girlfriend before getting physical with each other, or engaging in round robin relationships where both parties offer support but no commitments, like a friendship. The second strategy a woman can use to get what she wants is the so-called shit test. When you're dating and your partner does something that doesn't make sense because it's against their natural instincts, then chances are good this was designed as an experiment. You'll notice these types of behaviors more often from women than men, however, they work in reverse when guys do them too, like with sexual acts on occasion or by simply withdrawing sex altogether if things aren't going well between two people who were meant for each other. But, most true high-value men are able to make pass this shit test. The male and female strategies for handling one-night stands vary depending on how a woman feels about you. Your social awareness determines what kind of strategy each gender uses when dealing with them. Those who have high sexual market value might find themselves withholding sex unless they're sure things wouldn't lead anywhere farther than just casual dating.